Hello guys, welcome back to my channel. So two weeks ago, I started the Chloe Ting two week shred challenge. And can I just start by saying it was the hardest thing I have ever done in my life. So if you don't know who Chloe Ting is, she is a fitness YouTuber and she's super popular. She gets like millions of views and likes and just crazy. And she's put together these workout programs that are all free on her website and they go for different lengths. So the one I did was the two week shred challenge and it was seriously so hard. Like from the workouts being like physically hard to actually just being able to get up in the morning and get the workout done before the rest of my day. I really, really struggled with this challenge more so at the start. Um, it eventually got easier after about a week, but I definitely struggled a lot with this challenge. A lot of blood, sweat and tears went into it. Not really the blood, but the sweat and the tears definitely went into it. Definitely a lot, a lot of sweat because I'm just unfit. So I've always struggled with the motivation side of working out. I've never really been able to commit to working out for a long period of time. I sort of get these little bursts of motivation every now and then and I last maybe like a few days to a week and then it kind of backs off. And my diet is another thing that it's not good. I really struggle to eat healthy and I just really enjoy shit food pretty much so this challenge really pushed me to like i improved my diet for the two weeks and that definitely helped me with my results my results are literally amazing so make sure you stay tuned for the end to see my results i'm like so happy so i'll insert a little before clip right here i'm literally like so em not embarrassed but I was I'm really insecure about posting this because I was definitely not happy with the way I was looking after being in lockdown for however many months now I basically was just not doing any exercise and eating whatever I want and it got to the point where I was like I don't like what I'm seeing in the mirror anymore so my sister told me about this Chloe Ting two-week shred challenge that everyone was doing all over YouTube I personally hadn't seen any of the videos on YouTube before I started my video but I was seeing other people's results after two weeks like literally it's two weeks I was like I have to try this and just see if it works like worst case scenario I don't see any results but at least I've sort of got my ass into gear and started doing some exercise in lockdown so before we get started please make sure to smash a massive thumbs up this video literally took everything out of me and I put my heart and soul into this video so if you could give it a thumbs up that would mean everything to me and subscribe to my channel down below as well because that really helps me out too and without further ado let's get into the two week shred challenge prepare for day one it ain't pretty all right guys so this is day one i'm not happy with my body after lockdown at all so um basically this is what it looks like so it's just workouts every day for two weeks i'm obviously starting with day one which is right here This is like one of the hardest workouts I've ever done in my life. What are you doing? We're only halfway through. Oh my god. Alright. I'm now finished day one. And. freaking hard all right guys for day one breakfast i'm just having this i don't even know what this is it's the carmen's brand with yogurt and blueberries and just a protein shake as well this is what i'm going to be having every day for the two weeks i usually have this for breakfast anyway but yeah
Hey guys, so it's the end of day two now and I am in so much pain. My legs and hips are killing me and my abs are quite sore as well. I honestly don't know how I'm gonna do the workout tomorrow morning and I know that day three is quite a hard one as well because there's like four videos. But yeah, I'm currently just watching Love Rosie and I'm gonna get an early night tonight and let my muscles heal a little bit for tomorrow morning. Good night guys. Good morning guys. It is day three now and my muscles are feeling so much better since last night. I feel like an early night really helped me out. So this morning I'm working out in the garage because um it's a four video workout today so I feel like I need a bit more room. I don't want to be squished in this little area here that I was doing my workouts in so I'll show you the videos for today. So day three we have four videos and it's a 45 minute workout in total so so that's a little bit more difficult than what I'm used to from the past two days so probably going to be sore after this. In two days I get a rest day though so let's do this. I'm all done. Day three, that was by far the hardest day. I think the four workouts is just, it's just so much more compared to the two, obviously, but like it really, really pushed me today. So yeah, time for some breakfast and I will see you tomorrow. Good morning, everyone. It's day four. Yes, day four now. I'm starting to lose count. I found it so hard to get up this morning. Hey, stop it. Come on. So yeah, I found it really hard to get up this morning. It's been raining all night and it's so cold. But I'm going to head down to the garage now and get the workout done. It's only three videos this morning, which is good. So yeah, see you down there. Thought I'd just quickly show you guys these things. So they have no sugar in them or anything. I don't know if you're gonna be able to read that. But they're basically like these little, they're like little tea bag things that you put in your water to flavor them. Cause I personally want my water to have a little bit of flavor, but I don't want to have like cordial or anything like that. So they're really good if anyone wanted something for their water that doesn't have heaps of sugar in it. Okay guys, so I'm finished the first two videos that I've done every day, so I didn't oh, I'm not focused. Um, so I didn't film them because it was getting a little bit repetitive, but I'm now up to the core and arms video, so I thought I'd film this one. Hold me close till I get up. This is the hardest workout so far, like by far the hardest workout of this whole challenge. Hello guys, I have... Romeo, stop. So I have just woken up. It is day six. Yesterday was an active rest day, hence why there is no footage of me exercising. But yeah, thought I'd just quickly jump on here and let you know just so you didn't think that I was like skipping a day because I'm not. I'm very excited for today's workout because it's the lower body burn and I really enjoyed that one when we did it the other day. All 
Alrighty, I've just come to sit outside just to let myself cool down a little bit. Um, I'll give you a little update on my progress. So I'm definitely feeling stronger and the workouts aren't as hard anymore. So that's just proof that if it gets easier for me, it will definitely get easier for you. So if you are doing this challenge, just stick with it because around the day six, day seven mark, you will feel a difference. We have Hannah joining us today for our workout. Hi. How do you feel after your workout, Hannah? Really sore. <laughs> hey guys, so it's day seven now. I thought I was... Am I... I can't speak. <laughs> hey guys, so it's day seven now. So I thought I'd give you a little update on my results what we're looking like after seven days. I don't really see a major difference physically, but I feel better. And I, I suppose that's the main thing, right, Hannah? Yep. Hannah's just here as well. Excuse my effect tan as well at the moment. I've just filmed my filter by Molly May, which I'll leave a link to just up here. Um, the, the workouts are getting easier. Like this morning when Hannah and I did our workout, I definitely didn't struggle half as bad as what I did the first few days, but we do still have seven days until the end. So hopefully we'll be able to see some results in the next seven days. It's day nine now and it is another active rest day. I'm just enjoying my day off. I've got a Vietnamese noodle soup here and I'm just watching some YouTube and yeah, just chilling pretty much. Pacing back and forth. Oh, I don't understand why you're standing right here. All your shots have scored. No. Scratching at the scars you left on my skin We fight and we fall and we rise through it all Till we find what we want and we lose it all again Your touch on my skin, pull me close, take me in Just me, just you Hello guys, it is now day 13, oh wow, it is now day 13, I'm about to do my second last workout of the challenge and I'm so excited for it to be over, not gonna lie. <laughs> day 14 I'm so excited to have this workout challenge over with I just need a few days off um, but yeah let's finish this challenge I am finally finished all the workouts and I'm so happy about it I literally didn't think I'd be able to complete this challenge. I've never completed any challenge like this in my life. Even though it was only two weeks, it was still bloody hard, like the hardest thing I've ever done in my life. But I'm finally done. I'm so excited about it. Make sure you give this video a big thumbs up because I never thought I'd be able to do this. And this video deserves a like. So guys, we are now at the end of the two week shred challenge. I'm gonna put my results up on the screen right now. As you can see, 
I don't have abs in two weeks. Um, if you have body fat, that's nearly impossible to get like shredded abs in two weeks so my main goal was to sort of drop some body fat improve my diet feel better about myself and i've achieved all of those things so i'm super super happy please be sure to like this video and subscribe if you enjoyed and i will see you guys in my next video bye <laughs>